Good morning and thank you for joining our daily outlook. And today we'll cover the changes in gold. Greg will be sharing insights from our trading desk. The gold dollar pair made a minor downwards correction in the last session, dropping 0.1%. The ROC is giving a negative signal. The euro dollar pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, gaining 0.2%. The RSI is giving a positive signal. The pound dollar pair gained 0.4% in the last session. The stochastic indicator's positive signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. The Bitcoin dollar pair exploded 13.3% in the last session. According to the stochastic RSI, we are in an overbought market. Thank you for your insightful trading ideas. Moving on to world headlines. U.S. stock indexes fell from record highs as listed Chinese firms tumbled on tighter regulations at home. In a poor start to a week packed with technology earnings and a Federal Reserve meeting, Anthony Delorio, a co-founder of the Ethereum network, says he's done with the cryptocurrency world, partially because of personal safety concerns. With a market capitalization of almost $500 billion, the chipmaker NVIDIA is now worth nearly as much as semiconductor rivals Intel, Advanced Micro Devices, and Qualcomm combined. Thank you for this. Coming up, today's major economic events. The U.S. non-defense capital goods orders will be released at 1230 GMT, the U.S. consumer confidence at 1400 GMT, the U.S. durable goods orders at 1230 GMT. Finland's consumer confidence will be released at 500 GMT, Finland's unemployment rate at 500 GMT, Finland's industrial confidence at 500 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to log in tomorrow morning with the latest news and events from the financial market.